Now covering St. John's County, it is no secret that development is exploding there, but with that growth also comes the traffic. Backups on State Road 13 are now common during rush hour, and now the area is seeing an increase in accidents as well. Channel 4's Kristen Cosby is live along one of the busiest highways with the latest on this growing problem. We're out here in our live truck driving down State Road 13 at one particularly dangerous intersection. I want you to take a look right here at State Road 13 and Roberts Road. A lot of people who live out here in St. John's County work in Duval County. They're driving home from work. Traffic is really picking up and this intersection has proven to be quite a dangerous one just in the last few months. We heard it um, and we all pop up. We tend to go down and make sure that nobody needs immediate help if we can. There was a truck upside down and the other car was pretty smashed. And I know it blocked the road. Julie Wilkinson springs into action every time she sees an accident on State Road 13 in Roberts Road. She sees them frequently outside her Switzerland Animal Hospital office window. The most recent happened Saturday. Rush hour, it's always rough. I know it actually gets more congested going this way at rush hour in the evening. And yeah, the accidents are usually right around that time. The intersection saw two serious accidents in the last two weeks. According to the Florida Highway Patrol and the St. Johns County Sheriff's Office, about 30 crashes happened at this intersection in the last year. Those included this one from May 2016 that killed 35-year-old Jeremy Stratton. This one's getting worse. I've been here at the clinic for a year and a half, and it's getting worse just in the last probably six months. You really notice more and more accidents. And back out here live on State Road 13, you can see all the people coming home from work right now. We talked with the Florida Department of Transportation to find out if there was anything planned in terms of expanding State Road 13. It is four lanes here at this section, but it does go down to three once you hit Roberts Road. And the DOT tell me that not right now nothing is in the works for expansion, although they do have engineers who are out here constantly monitoring the traffic patterns for safety. Reporting live in Fruit Cove, Kristen Cosby, Channel 4, The Local Station.